freeze. Don't say stage freeze, just do it. I can feel the blood creeping up from the heathens. Got will, got fight, got pride, got reason. If they want to go eat, then you know I'm going to feed them. If you're coming for me, hope you're ready for a demon. Hey guys. Hey. Back out again with It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia. This is season three, episode uh, seven. So uh, last episode we left off with, um, I guess they tried to solve the North Korea um, problem. problem. But it, they were, it was, it was be, it was like a... You know, uh, a bar yeah. crawl yeah. situation, and they wanted to know the secret yeah. ingredient in their microbrew, um, which we never got. Yeah. <laughs> so if you don't know, Carson Hill, I love how they said we need to solve the North Korea uh, problem. Where I kind of feel like they were the problem, not not their situation with the bar. You know, like them going over. Um, I feel like that they, they, not the Koreas were the problem. It was uh, the gang. You know, which I thought was funny. Yeah, that is the that yeah. is the issue here. <laughs> yeah, it's like, oh, what's in the what's in the micro brew? You know, it's like maybe they have a better brew than you guys. You know, what was Frank trying to put in it? He was trying to add like um, something for sweetener. I don't know, it's weird. Oh, uh, antifreeze. Yeah, antifreeze. In there, <laughs> I don't know. Probably. And they were mixed. They were mixing it in a garbage yeah. can. Which I don't think they cleaned beforehand, yeah. so it was nasty. And yeah, would it be all like room temperature? How do you keep that cold? You know, so I mean, do you keep it in the freezer? Do you have a giant freezer? Maybe they have a walk-in, uh, like refrigerator, yeah. but because you can't put ice in a beer, that's yeah. like you don't do that. So, <laughs> so I, mean, <laughs> I have yeah, no idea. I don't know. They're I think they're just bound to fail. Anyway, uh, let's just stop this one, guys. If you guys get the full reaction, check out the Patreon, all that good stuff, and here we go. Secret tunnels, then. Secret tunnels. Secret tunnels. Secret tunnels. Customers still in there. <laughs> oh, are you applying for a job here? Here? Yeah. Are you crazy? Gross. No, I would never work here. I'm working here. Yeah. Yeah. I thought you worked at the coffee shop. Um. Yeah, I do still, but a Starbucks moved in across the street, and they're stealing all our business. Right across mm. the street. Well, that is good to know. I love Starbucks. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, 
fine, then we'll go with the original offer. No. Except something substantially bit. less. I'll so it's a bit hot. And offer you nothing. Damn. That's what happens. You guys get too fucking greedy. You would not bring You sold me half your shares of the bar for goods and services. Well, wait, wait a second. You definitely give me half your shares too, dude. Well, maybe I gave you guys a couple shares. My back was against the wall. I need a little breathing room. Bro, you gave me a shitload of shares one time for a half a sandwich. Here, get a job. Oh, get a job? Yeah. Just get a job? Why don't I strap on my job helmet and squeeze that into a job cannon and fire off at the job land where jobs grow on jobbies? Now we're wasting time. We yeah. just get out of here. What's your plan? I'm thinking. Yeah, but while you've been picking up bar horse, I have been double-dropping like a bastard out there. Nice. Oh my god, you're 
double dropping again, Dean? Oh, I never stopped double dropping. That is unbelievable. What? This is my job. I have to report you two. Wow. Wow. This? You know what, Dennis? I took a chance giving you a job here, and you're really screwing me over. Oh, wait, are you being so needy? You realize how attractive that is to me? Don't you want to be attractive to me? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> All right, ladies. So Don't you want to be attractive to me? <laughs> You know, I gave them a chance to work here, and now they're stealing from the restaurant, and I'm gonna get fired. What? They're stealing? Yes! I'll tell you what, I will take care of Dennis and Dee for you, alright? Thanks, Charlie. That's really nice of you. How about a hug? Cheer you up. Well, a, a quick one. Oh, for real? You know, I feel like it, in the first oh, season, the she I was more of a bitch. Oh, this you. one, not so much. Wow, like, why are you so. Oh. Well, actually, sir, we are here just to talk. I'm not buying your bar. Look out. You better not mess with us. You see Hawkey over here? Not sure what he's capable of. Is that right? You got something to say, old man? <laughs> oh, my God. And his... <laughs> Guess what? I'm slaughtered. Corporate's on their way down here right now to fire your asses. What? You told on us? Babe, don't do that to me. I feel like we're getting so close, sweet baby. Are you saying? He doesn't even know your name. Yeah. Your name? What is it? Beautiful. Oh, my God. <laughs> you're you're beautiful a Beautiful all the time. Wow. You're, okay, these are the two that were stealing. I know you. And you. You're the guys <laughs> on that dive bar down the street. You're the corporate dude with the helicopter. Your friends in the doo-wop group that showed up in my house and attacked me. Of them died on my doorstep, and it just it sort of put me in a funk. So I'm gonna clean house, and you're all fired. What? 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 Did you did you hire these people? She sure did. She, she hired the manager. Yeah. And then, then clearly you're an idiot because these people are psychopaths. <laughs> but no, you're not fired. I'm just kidding. You are. Everybody get the hell out of here. Oh, I feel bad actually for her. Now how am I gonna pay for my rent next month, huh? Don't worry about it. Come have a beer, right? Oh my god. No one cares, you know? <laughs> I guess. I think it was just the character I was Oh, was like, did the character, I mean, the actors really die? I hope not, because I'm sad. Sad, yeah. Uh, okay, this episode was actually not that bad. I thought it was good. I liked this yeah. one more than the last episode. Yeah. I thought that it was, um, I liked that doo section. Yeah. Really fun. Um, and how mm. they even opened the episode, they were arguing about random stuff. <laughs> and then like the, then you realize that <laughs> that guy was right there listening to them I'm like oh my god <laughs> that's you know, what it kind of reminded me of this um movie dumb and dumber you know it's the second movie it's a terrible movie but um i think it was like a scene where like he's like practicing what he's gonna say in front of like the dad but he's saying it all in front of the dad <laughs> it's like what are you talking about it kind of reminded me of that scene um but again that's the episode of the whole. I like, um, I think you're right though about the waitress though. It's like she did seem a little um, like annoyed during the first season. But again, I would say that they were still trying to figure out the characters around that time. Yeah. Uh, like D was a lot nicer in the first season, you know. Yeah, yeah she was. So, but now I'm definitely seeing yeah. she. You know, like, I kind of feel like if she wasn't such an asshole, you would kind of feel sorry for her that she just lost her job. But. She's now, she's like, oh, I'm just going to double dip. I'm forcing you to do, like, sign my, uh, you know, my application, you know? It's like, you don't have the balls, or not the balls, but you don't have, like, the DC of just doing it yourself, you know? Yeah. Yeah. But I feel like, you know, that's, I'm glad that she is like that because yeah. I want her to um, be able to be as stupid as that voice, yeah. right? Because yeah. that's what you want. It would get kind of annoying that you have like, oh, the one girl saying, oh, stop it, boys. Yeah. Or they're acting all like immature. Exactly. Yeah. I yeah. want her to be able yeah. to do these jokes and not be the butt of the joke. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Um, For me though, I like the waitress the way she is. Like, I think the first season, I don't know, I, I, 
the annoying thing, I feel like that could have run its course after a while. But over here, it's like they just do stuff just to fuck with her, you know. And I think the Dennis thing, I never understood why she liked Dennis, and I don't remember her ever liking Dennis. So, well, they had a date, and I think they slept yeah. with each other, and she just, really I liked him. Never, never but Dennis like never him. called her back. Yeah. Um, I thought so, she hated the whole gang, but I didn't realize she's had it for Dennis. Well, maybe they're gonna. Maybe that's what they're gonna yeah. run with. Yeah. When, when, when with that story, but I just I kind of liked when she was like irritated with them because yeah. I don't know I just felt like it was kind of funny. Yeah. You know. Um. Again, great episode, guys. If you guys want the full reaction, you know what to do. Check out the Patreon. We'll see you guys next week. Bye.